What is going on guys and welcome to episode 49 of my Need for Speed Most Wanted 2012 Let's Play. Now in this episode, instead of focusing on one specific car, I'm going to do one event in a in this car and then one event in a different car and then one event in a different car and so on and so on and so on. So, I think this would kind of mix it up a little bit and it'll like it'll make me have to really think and have to switch between driving styles really quickly. So, the first thing we're going to do is we're going to do a uh, smash and grab event in the Lamborghini Gallardo Performante. Then after that, honestly, I don't know what I'm going to switch to. I'm going to try and switch to something that's just random. Um, I'll find... I'll just find something and switch to it, basically. Um, yeah, skipping that intro, don't even care. Um... Go ahead and head for that! Oh my god, that was horrible! Okay. Boom! Alright, now, they go through here. Ah, that was bad. Pick that up. Whoa, bring it around. That was a bad one again. Bring it around, bring it around. Come on. Now, head for the staircase. Actually, no, don't head for the staircase just yet. Let's take these out. Oh, and now you can head up the staircase. There we go. And this time, don't even turn back like you did with the ZR1. Come on. Now, yes. Not exactly as I had hoped, but... Now, boost, 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 boost. There we go. Now boost some more, and boom! Boom! <laughs> oh, got around the side, around the side, around the side! Okay, now, where we want to go? We got to pick this one up, back up. Now, I know exactly what I want to do here. The only problem that I had last time with this was I actually had too much speed uh, going off the jump uh, that I was trying to hit the billboard with. So, I'm going to go, I'm going to boost a little bit. But then I'm not going to actually boost anymore going off this jump. And hopefully, yes! I, like, uh, broke the billboard with my tires, basically. There, <laughs> That billboard was like, I almost flew right over it. But thankfully, I didn't fly over it because I wanted to actually get the points and win. So, um, just got to pick up a few more of these gates and I'll have this, uh, have this win in the bag. So, let's see. Get up and goal! I, yeah, I was like, oh. We do have gold, don't we? <laughs> Let's try and get as many of these signs as I can. Boom. And, oh wait, there's some more over there, but then, yeah, I don't have time. Got drift tires. And again, second on the speed wall. Didn't beat my ZR1 score, which is a bit disappointing, but I don't really care, to be honest with you. Uh, let's see, drift tires. Uh, yeah, why not? Alright, now... Next car, let's see, wait for the menu to load, and come on, come on, come on, come on, there we go, okay, uh, change car to a, hmm, let's see, hmm, you know what, you know what, you know what, Pagani Waira, haven't used that car in a while, and I'm gonna try and use cars that I haven't, haven't used in a long time, so we're gonna try the Pagani Waira, and see what events I haven't completed in that, and hopefully complete them. <laughs> Pretty straightforward, I think. Oh my god, I love the Wyra. It's so beautiful. <laughs> oh my god, but seriously, the Wyra is just... The Wyra is sexy. There's no... It, it's just it's beautiful. There's no doubt about that. Okay, uh, races. Oh wow, there's a ton of things to do with this thing. A ton! I could make this episode just about this one car, but I'm not going to do that. I'm not going to do that. Uh, because I have other ones to do. Let's do a... Hmm... What should we do? Let's do this medium sprint race. Medium difficulty sprint race. So, shouldn't be too hard, but it should, um... But it should give me a little bit of a challenge, so we'll see. Skip the intro. And wait for, like... It's funny how you skip the intro, but it still has this little extra part to go at the end. Love the sound of this twin-turbo V12. Oh, my God. Twin-turbo AMG V12. What a sound. That was one thing they did get really, really right with this game. Um, was the sounds. They did... Oh, God! That was bad. Bad. Horrible. Yeah, they got the sounds 
perfect uh, in this game. If you go, like, listen to the cars in this game, well, most of them anyway, like the Wyra, for example, and then listen to a video of a real Wyra, they're actually really, really, really similar. Really similar. So, they, EA, I, I give them props for doing a good job on the car audio. It's not as good as, um, as say, Forza, but it's, like, worlds above Gran Turismo sounds, that's for sure. I mean, I don't care what the creator says. Those sounds are not realistic. I mean, a Ferrari F430 is, is supposed to sound... It, a real Ferrari F430 sounds like a... Sounds like a screaming Italian V8. Whereas the Ferrari F430 in Gran Turismo 5 sounds like a vacuum cleaner. So they didn't really do a good job on the sounds in Gran Turismo 5. I don't care what anybody says. Hopefully they do a better job uh, with Gran Turismo 6, which is a game I do want to play. I want to get my hands on that game eventually, but I really hope they up their game on the sounds. Do not pass me. Do not pass me. No! No! Oh, right at the end. Oh, my God. You freaking McLaren. I hate you. I think it was a McLaren or was it an Aventador? It was either a McLaren or an Aventador. I didn't really see because I was focusing on that uh, Zonda R that attempted to take me out. Uh, apply the track tires. Ah. No, it was a McLaren. And yeah, you deserve that. You deserve what you got. All right. Well, didn't do so well in that one, but it's on to the next car in the next race. So let's see. Change car. And... Da -da 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 -da. You know what? Jag XKR. I haven't really used the Jag XKR at all. Like, I mean, at all. <laughs> so, I mean, if they had the XKRS in this game, or better yet, the XKRS GT. Oh my god, the XKRS GT. If they had that in this game, I would be using that thing all the time. Now, let's see. Races. Uh, let's do the easy circuit race so we can actually get nitrous for this thing. Continental Drift. <laughs> oh, drifting. Oh, <laughs> Tokyo Drift. Alright, he load. And let the camera flip. There we go. Alright, let's chase down this 4C. Get him out of the way. And I see an M3, which is basically XKR food. Not really. The M3 is... Uh, I would rather have an M3 over an XKR. I think the M3 is a much more precise car, a much more balanced car than the XKR. But, I don't know. I mean, actually, you know what? I, I, I take back that statement because, because there's a little bit more passion in an XKR, isn't there? But, well, th but then again, M3 has quite a lot of heritage, but uh, I, I don't know if it comes close to the, to the passion in an XKR. The XKR is such a passionate machine that it's, it's, I mean, it has the heritage, but it also has... The growl and the, you know, it's it's a jag. Like, as Top Gear, as, as Top Gear once said, it it's a jag. Because that's what it is. It's a jag. It's it's cool. <laughs> Just gotta get past this 911. And I'm in first. And as long as I can stay there without distracting myself by trying to imitate Top Gear voices, I should be good to go. <laughs> Keep it going. Yes. It's boring being all up here. <laughs> it's like there's no competition up here anymore. I'm bored. Nobody to take down. <laughs> it's okay, though. It's okay, though, because as long as I've secured a win, I'm good. Whoa, 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 whoa. Too much looking back. I almost messed that win up <laughs> because I was looking back. And let's see if I can keep this drift going. No. Uh, yeah. No. No, 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 no. Didn't have enough speed for that. Although I do want to change the color. Eh. Silver. I wouldn't have mine in silver. I'd have it in a real bright poppy color. Like, not, like, a, a, when I say poppy, I mean a color that pops. Like a pop-ing, pop-ish, pop-y color. Like, if you know what I mean. If you understand what I mean. I, <laughs> um, I'm probably explaining it in the worst, like, most undescriptive way that I possibly can. But, I mean, I don't know. <laughs> as long as I'm explaining it, then as long as I'm explaining it, then I should be able to get my message across. Sometimes I can, sometimes I can't. But it all depends. All depends on how, how crazy, <laughs> it all depends on how crazy of a, of a commentator I am feeling uh, at that particular moment. 
And there's the finish line and the cross the line in 2 minutes 42.48. And that was the worst British accent I've ever heard in my entire life. Probably because I did it. Okay, off-road tires, I do not want those. Uh, burn nitrous, I do want those. Er, those. That. And I want to say, I think, one more car. One more car. One more car. And as soon as the freaking menu loads, good grief. Where did he come from? Where the heck did he come from? <laughs> that was weird. Alright, uh, not races. Change car, and this will be the last one for this, um... Ah, for this episode... Let's see. What does Pontiac have? Oh, the Firebird. I've already done that. Let me see. Da -da 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 Um. Oh gosh. You know what? You know what? Uh. R35. I haven't used the R35 in a while. I've used the R34 um a little bit. I well, I haven't really used it in videos that much, but I've been using it for actually playing the game. Um. But I haven't been using the R35 in videos or in the regular game that much so we're gonna see what we can do with it now let's see races oh wow i need to do like everything for it <laughs> uh let's go ahead and just do the circuit race and it's one that i've never done before how's that possible played this game for a long time i've got over whoa d -d 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 traffic car i hate you so much anyway once i come out of my like little rage moment um, I can't believe I haven't actually used this thing at all in the, uh, career mode. I mean, it's like, at all. It's, there's just no way. Get around you, van! Oh, wait, I missed my corner. Big time. Big time. 2.4 miles to go. And there should be a repair shop up here where I can repair this thing. I hope there is. I even hit, I hit a traffic car, and the cops didn't even chase me. Dang, I'm like, really lucky with these cops today, because they haven't been chasing me at all in any of these little, um, any of these, uh, episodes that I've done so far. I've done the, uh, oh gosh, what was the other episode I did today? The ZR1, and, wait a minute, yeah, I took a wrong, well, I didn't take a wrong turn, I missed my turn! Alright, spin around. Nah. Not so good, but whatever. Come on. Sounds really good in the tunnel, though. I, I have to admit that. It sounds really, really good. In fact, there is one of these uh, that actually... Uh, there's an uh, R35 GTR with an Alpha 9 kit um, that hangs out in my town quite a bit. And, oh my god, that thing sounds like a beast. In fact, it actually... Um, uh, it, uh, whoever was driving, uh, one time used launch control next to me at a stoplight, and wow, that was, like, insane when he, <laughs> he just used launch control randomly at this stoplight, and, I mean, just talk about, like, forget about zero to sixty, like, zero to spec in a very short amount of time, like, zero to, like, a spec in my win- like, way far ahead of me, uh, in, like, it seemed like, you know, less than 2.8 seconds. It was just crazy. Absolutely, uh, insane speed out of that Alpha 9 GTR. Just crazy. I don't see it as much as I used to, but I'm starting to see it more again. So, hopefully, like, if I spot it, I might be able to get some video of it for you guys, because it's a beast-looking car. Uh, what's this intro doing? Like, just random camera shots and, like, racing shots and a couple of shaky cams. Now, that's basically all there is to it. I can't believe it's making me race evokes. There's no way a GTR would ever get mashed up against an evoke because a GTR would, like, would basically stomp on an evoke any day of the week. Just, I don't even know why the game would put me in a race with an evoke. Why, game? Why you do this? Why you do this? Goodbye, Audi. Yeah, goodbye, Udi. <laughs> Udi. And another GTR to take out. What? You went that way. Yeah, he's had enough of that. 
Okay, now come on. Drift it, drift it, drift it. God. Where's your power? I want nitrous so bad. Ugh. See my trunk bouncing up and down. That's not good. Lap two. Well, that's a pretty short circuit. He crashed himself out. <laughs> this is mine now. Unless the cops get me, which is highly doubtful because they're in Crown Vicks. But you never know with this, uh, with the crazy, crazy, crazy catch-up uh, like system in this game because they, oh my God, they can make a Crown Vic catch up to a Hennessy Venom. The catch-up uh, mechanic is just like, I mean, I want to say, I don't want to say like, what well, you know what? I was gonna say I don't want to say overdone, but it is overdone. It's unrealistically overdone. I mean, and I understand how they have to do that in order to keep the game interesting, but, I mean, dang, if they, like, if they want to make it even, oh, God, that was, like, a crash just waiting to happen back there, even though it didn't happen. Come on, GTR. All we have to do is hold this lead, GTR, and we're good to go. Finish line is in sight. Go, 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 go. Boom. All right. Two minutes, three seconds, point three. Sixth on the leaderboard. Which is not that great. <laughs> um, I mean, it was okay. Uh, Off-road tires, absolutely not. Burn nitrous, yes. Yes, yes. Okay, spin around. And park. And, oh, actually, I can't park it and finish the episode yet because I gotta get away from these cops. Otherwise, uh, not gonna go well. Why am I not moving? There we, ah, because I was taken down and it was like a weird glitch be that it does after. Um, don't bust me, don't bust me, don't bust me, please. Thank you. Goodbye. Just gotta shake this cop. Oh, break, 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 break. Is he gonna pass me? Yes. <laughs> and lines up to be taken out. What? How did that not take him out? There's no way that he, like, just survived that. That doesn't even make sense. It doesn't work that way. It really doesn't work that way. Now boost! Whoa, 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 whoa! Head over this way. Head out on the highway. Perfect. All right, now that I'm in cooldown, I know a spot up here that I can hide, so it should be good to go. As far as like where to hide. Yes, this is perfect. All right, spin around real quick and shut that engine down. And evaded. All right. Well, if you guys uh, enjoyed that episode, that episode that was like slightly different, uh, don't forget to click that like button. Tell me in the comments below what you thought. And subscribe if you are new to my channel. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Talk to you later.